No apologies necessary, Henry. Well then. I suppose I'll be on my way then. Yes, I as well. I wish you luck. him, doesn't it? He found an item. Fluorescent honey. Guess we can talk to this guy. Hello there, Herschel. Le looking well, my boy. Looking well, my boy. Good evening, Hasha. I mean, Lionel. I saw that scrawny friend of yours yet. Henry shopping for the Ascots. They they're sure to make him pull his weight. What? What? What little love there is. <laughs> I could never be be a servant like him. I'm too independent. Mother told me to fix her garden well. I'm doing it by myself. That was supposed to be Italian, but it ended up being something else. Puzzle number 20. Nine red bricks. Lionel is contemplating... Com contemplating, yeah. That's what I said it the first time. A row of n nine bricks for his mother's garden wall. Two adjacent bricks in a row are much heavier than the rest. But he can't remember which. He, he decided the only way to identify them is to lift them one, one by one. But to save time, he wants to do it in the most efficient way possible. He can work out the maximum number of bricks he needs to lift in order to find the two heavy ones? Well, if he goes, uh, well, there are nine bricks, right? And, uh, if whichever two he lifts up, he, I think he gets rid of the lighter one. So, that get, that gets rid of one. <laughs> and, um, uh, that would be like half of them. And... So that's... Four. So, yeah. It's a, you know, he lifts up two... Each, each brick pair by pair, right? Like, these two, these two, these two, and these two. And, uh... I dropped my stylus. Hold on. And out of those eight, he uh, gets rid of the lighter of the two, of each pair. And then he goes from there until he gets, until he gets the two heavier ones. So, so it's four. I think this may be it. Looks as if I got it. Correct, it's four. You might start out by lifting bricks two and four and six. If one of them is heaviest, he can lift them he can lift the neighboring brick. If that brick isn't also heavy, then he knows the next one on the other side is. If none of the two bricks out of two, four, and six are heavier than the rest, he can simply lift nine. He can simply lift nine. If nine is heavier, then eight must be the other heaviest brick. If nine isn't heavier, then it has to be seven or eight. 
Well, that's another way of going about it. Oh, right, clever. Oh, right, clever. Thanks. It just feels good to get things done on my own. Happy to help. Good luck with the wall. Oh, I know that. I only know how. Know how as in knowledge. Not know how as in not being able to do something that is. Now what? Back to the mask. Who's that? Who the heck? Who the heck are you? So it's a nest. Hmm. All right, let's talk to this guy. What could father have gone off to? I'm starting to get a little worried. Oh, hey there, Herschel. Why are you worried? Have you seen my father, Doug? No, then. No, can't say I have. But why, but why are you here? Uh, Herschel, my lad. All about hand with this puzzle, eh? Puzzle number twenty-one. A lick of paint. about that the prospective prospective tenants of this row of houses have some unusual requirements I, w I want to live next to a red house says one two no blue neighbors please oh and the house at the end of the at the end is out of qu the question three two says two neighbors down from a yellow house and no neighbors as the same color as us and four I'm fine with any color as long as it's not blue or red can you repaint just one house that every tenant could have their dream home touch the color house to change it to change its color so I want to live next to a red house. No blue neighbors. Two doors down from a yellow house. Fine with whatever color as long as it's not blue or red. Hmm. Well. <sighs> Two doors down from... Them yellow, huh? No blue neighbors. I'm out. Let's do this. Want to live next to a red house. So, red, 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 and red. No blue neighbors. So, two doors down from a yellow house. Yeah, what? No blue neighbors. Fine with that. So, that doesn't have, this house doesn't have blue neighbors. And then there's, there's, these two are next to a red house. Yeah, this one does have blue neighbors and these two are next to a red house. 
two doors down from a yellow house. So that's here, this. And two doors down. Yeah, this one. Fine with any colors. So, yeah. I'm not certain. Did I get it? Repainting the rightmost house yellow satisfies all the tenants' conditions. Never mind the cost of materials and labor. The landlady ought to charge all four of them to paint for the time it took to work out which house to paint. Bunny plays for the last. You're truly your father's son. By the way, what what did you say you were up to? Father left the house earlier. Mother sent me to look for him. Lucille's worried, eh? That's a new one. <laughs> but if I see Roland, I'll let him know. Thank you, Doug. Well, time to head out to the woods. Into the woods to find Rowan! Oh, there he is. Hey, Dad! Oh, well, Herschel's dad, anyway. Not my dad, my dad... Works at the post office. Father, there you are. Why, hello, Herschel. And yes, here I am. What were you so right riled up about? Mother said you were dragged away by a group of strangers. She practically, she's practically beside herself. Your mother worries about the rising and setting of the sun. I told her those were some old friends. She didn't seem to think they were friends of yours. She also said they were actually looking for me. Oh, you were a baby when they last saw you. They wanted to see you all grown up. And as you can see, I've escaped sent doom at the hands of my old mates. The, the case of the disappearing father is solved. But what are you doing out here? Oh, my mates wanted to see the Norway Wall. If you don't know what you're looking for, it's not an easy thing to find. So they were sightseeing out there? I know it may seem hard to believe, but back when the wall was first discovered, terrorists streamed to our, into our little town. They came in droves all year round, day and night, just to see the nowhere wall. I can hardly imagine this as Sansbury being any sort of tourist attraction. Oh, and there was quite a surge of interest in archaeology here. Scho scholars and teachers even started moving into town. They were hoping to decipher the writing on the wall. Some folks believe it had secrets, but to an unknown civilization. You're starting to sound like Randall. Yes, your friend Randall is rather charming and well-spoken, isn't he? Very intelligent too. <laughs> Let's be off. If we keep your mother waiting any longer, then have to peel her off the ceiling with the garden rake. <laughs> right. Let's go. Well, first 